Before we talk a little bit more about astrology, I want to give you an understanding of why it can be a little complicated and why some people steer away from it. With astrology, you could go to, into a very in-depth astrological chart, which is called a natal chart. Uh, this chart deals with the 12 houses. In order to go into a very detailed account, it takes uh, a lot of calculations, a lot of mathematics, and a lot of time. <clears throat> so a lot of people lean away from that because they don't want to get involved with those calculations. To understand astrology, you don't have to do those calculations. You could do a, a overview of your astrological sign, which would include the, the sun sign, the ascendant, and the um, moon sign. And, and that would give you a really good basic understanding. One, I want to show you how astrology is done with a visual. And you could buy these at any, I think I got this one at Walmart. Okay, when you look at one of these diagrams of the constellations, you'll see that it's listed by month, July, June, May, April, March, February. And depending on the day you'll move and the time, let's say it is 7 o'clock on May 17th, that shows you different constel constellations that are present to you. Uh, they're at different degrees of length depending on the latitude if we're born um, above the equator or below it has a lot to do with mostly the the ascendant more so than any other sign these this shows you where the different constellations are uh, at this specific time so you have an idea if someone's born on may 17th at 7 7 p.m uh, looking at the south side you'll see the different constellations that um, that the person came through and what what the different degrees could be. This you don't have to know, but this gives you an understanding of how a astrology is calculated. And it's mostly done by mathematics and it's done by looking at uh, tables of calculations. But this will give you a good visual to say now I, now I have an understanding of how I could be considered a crab, which would be cancer. And that's, this visual is as good as enough as going outside and looking up at the stars at nighttime. So this is just to create a visual for you to let you know that uh, this is a, a science, even though it is a soft science, and it is based on all the stars and the constellations in the sky.